Hello everyone. I like to share with you a few trades posted on 6th of September after Labor Day's holiday by our graduate students and global instructors. First, uh, there are several posts from profitable students uh, on their track records and equity curves of months of August. So this is from MG, uh, who's been posting uh, almost uh, every day some trades and you see the results of the race trades on the month of august resulted uh, in his uh, forex trading accounts with this profit and is using mostly setup t so his win rate is 70 percent and with good average to loss ratio and very low drawdown <laughs> about one percent uh, is uh, taking profits on his private accounts and getting ready for the bigger funds on the fund providers and prop firms. Thanks, MG, for sharing your trades with us and also your equity curve. Uh, this one sh was shared by Castro, or global instructors that is trading his private accounts on Forex Broker and also re replicating the same thing on the FTMO and other fund providers. So there was some a small drawdown here around three percent but anyway he recovered uh, nicely and uh, made about 16k here on his bigger account so you see uh, he's using a um, mix of setup c and t so his win rate is about 60 percent but has much bigger win to loss ratio and is very consistent thanks castle for sharing your trades on a daily basis and supporting students and your equity cares with us. Uh, this equity care was shared by MF that, that uh, you know he's trading a lot of forex pairs. Uh, this was shared by MF that you've seen a lot of trades on forex pairs from him and this is his private small account that he is trading and preparing also himself for the big firm of fund providers and you see his consistency is really uh, nice with only 4% drawdown and he's using setup T so his win rate is about 80% and the rest is according to a standard setup T that provides very low drawdown and uh, high profit factor. So thank you very much MF for sharing your trades and equity cares and good luck in passing your combine. These are several trades uh, posted by Ren, our global instructor and also programmer that he's using robot uh, with his uh, skill of programming. Robot detected in four hours a breakout in Euro AUD. That means in four hours the pullback got completed. Now using a smaller chart, uh, he enters uh, frequently in the direction of main trend which is uptrend and scalp it as you see here. Also the robot that uh, scans a smaller time frame to see uh, that if there are high probability trading area between one hour, four minute and one, one minute charts uh, was sending signal on NASDAQ here and all these trades was essentially taken using one minute charts because it detected uh, very good uh, trends aligned with the three charts and here also the robot detected on on pound usd the same thing on one minute chart uh, there was alignment with the channel of 15 minute and one hour so there was an uh, opportunity to enter here and exit with three targets uh, based on exit strategy number three so this uh, this kind of signal is good for scalping and most of us usually a scalp in one minute or a smaller time frame against bigger time frames. So this way we don't need to wait and uh, look at many charts because this scans all the markets and provides signal to students who passed all the uh, modules and are ready to manage the trades properly. So thanks Ren for sharing uh, your trades and signals with all the students and I appreciate that. Uh, these are clips from MF who's uh, taking long position on cat Japanese yen. Uh, there was alignment between the 30 minute, five minute, one minute charts after the breakouts 
uh, and as you see the channel is forming here on the structural charts and you see better the entry on one minute chart based on algo four and five he entered here uh, several position and taking profit in the middle and the upper part of channel according to the system so that's a live clip of his trades let's see what happens looks like reached one target uh, moving the stop to break even waiting for either other targets or break up this trend line which is important that means momentum is lost and sellers came back so he's tightening up the stop and either he comes with the target hit or with profit here so he finished with some profit here all these three targets also he took another wave again another pullback came and the same channel and he's aiming for a small scalp here he waited for the pullback to be completed on entry chart and then after that saw the opportunity to enter a very good area and reach the target in the previous resistance and higher time frames so that's the live clip of his trades first target then break even adjustment and looking to see if other targets filled so that's done great thanks mf for sharing your trades and equity curves with us uh, these are the trades shared by castro or global instructor he shorted first the uh, dow jones industrial average uh, you see it on cfd here but he's taking also futures position on the combined account and his personal account here there was a reduction in momentum in this downtrend and testing a, a strong support area that got rejected so after doing analysis of momentum using the range line analysis and you can see it using trend line analysis when it breaks at this point which is very critical and it converts the, it uses this as a base to act as a support now which was previously resistance if, if it was going up at this point was best to enter using this channel so he's explaining this to students so as you see this was good to set enter with setup c and aim for the target on the other side of channel uh, a major resistance so he's already in profit and moved the stop loss to break even and passed unlocked profit and as you see it reached target around this area now you see he sees again that sellers came back and you can see the channel is going down and he shorted again here this was reversal so he took a small position this short positions are along aligned with the higher time frame so it's higher probability so he uses multiple large contracts and take big profits and his trade here so far after entering here he moved the stop here and locked this much profit and uh, if you check the chart reaching this target as well and uh, take profit on his personal account and also the combined thanks castro for sharing your trades with us and equity cares and training all the students to become consistent the next trade was shared by Yan. Trades on personal account. You see four hours, 30 minute and three minute charts on S&P were aligned. So we have high probability trading area and low risk scenario. So in two positions based on the path algo four, four, five and entry signal and exit strategy number one, which is the middle of channel uh, and reached all these targets. So thank Yan for sharing your trades and helping the students. This is also a clip of live trades I shared with the students uh, before the ISM news release. I saw uptrend 
opportunity waiting for pullback so a small number of positions now to test and see and reach a stop here now because buyers are coming back here I entered now fill my position now I have holding four positions and it seems buyers are coming back and this pullback is completed and waiting for this to reach the target and manage this automatically with the ninja trader so another pullback so that was kind of uh, trades just before the news release it's two, two minutes before the news release and then volatility will go up and suddenly the market become crazy and directionless so i hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day